hello my friends and welcome to today's video so today's video if you cannot tell is how to try and be molly may copy her hairstyle she's obviously released her new waiver with beauty works so the waiver it's not a molly may one but it's still a beauty works one i'm oh, just gonna tell you some do's and don'ts on how i managed to get this look because I've had some bad experience with it, but you know, we, we resolved it. And this is the final look. So if you want to see how I got this look, then please keep watching. Okay, so step one to wanting to be Molly May is you need the hair. So obviously this is the state of my hair. I washed it this morning and oh yeah, I wanted to show you just what I used to kind of prep it. I have this Moroccan oil curl defining cream. So I just use two pumps of this off when my hair was like drying it's made my hair i can't lie like it feels like you know there's product in there and i'm really not a fan of how it is but i'm like i feel like because i want them to stay nicely this using this will really help so this is how it comes wrong way around hello so this is how it comes i actually got mine off pretty little thing because there was like 10 percent off and i had free next day delivery so i paid 63 pounds for them but i know on the beauty works website they are 70 pounds i believe but like there's always i think molly may and like loads of people have discount codes like 10 percent off but nhs they have 20 percent off so yeah it comes in this big box inside the box is your heat resistant okay so let me take this out i'm not gonna lie right okay before we start i have actually used this i used it like as soon as i got it because i just really wanted to try it and it didn't go to plan and there are many reasons for it i'm gonna kind of show on the screen why it just didn't like the end result so basically because i have quite thick hair i was like right let's section it off i did literally four sections with the waver because it's quite hard to to know where to put it i was kind of doing it at, at angles and i was doing it quite close to the roots so by the time we got to the end it was like an afro so i've like just kind of watched a few other videos and learning as we go how to actually do it so yeah this is the heat resistant case really good for traveling obviously if we are molly may then we do go traveling a lot and then nice and protected in here and this is the styling one so it's actually massive like it's huge it's really cute obviously it's the signature beauty works oldie color the nice white handle so i didn't get the molly may one for obvious reasons because it's more expensive and all you get extra is is pink but these are still cute the clips i've got some from primark for one pound fifty and a brush oh no it's a comb isn't it and i've got combs so i was like let's be cheap so i'm gonna plug them in and kind of prep my hair and we'll go from there okay so you can see here it says off i think it goes up to 220 i had it on 180 last time but i am gonna up that to 200 just because that's like what ghds and stuff are so while they're warming up it does like show you what the temperature is so you know when they're ready i'm just gonna prep my hair i'm gonna use the beauty works 10 and 1 miracle spray because this has got a heat defense in it Another thing when I did it before, it literally took me maybe like an hour and 20 minutes. Whereas I've seen some people say that they can do it in like 10 or less with extensions. So I think whatever I was doing was just not right because people do it when they have extensions, which obviously thickens your hair. What I'm going to do is section it into two and we're going to work from the bottom. But what we're going to do also last time I used them like this, whereas I saw Molly uses it like this. Apparently it gives it a nicer shape. That's what I'm going to be doing and we'll see how long this takes. Okay, so we're almost ready. So take a minute, two minutes to heat up, which is fine. Brush your hair, make sure it's not frizzy. A little while to get there. Okay, we're ready. So let's just put some to the back. I'm just going to brush down each strand as well. Okay, so we need to keep it as flat as possible like horizontal sorry so i'm just gonna hold it there maybe like 10 15 seconds okay and then when you move it down you want to make sure that it's going where it sat last time and i know it's really hard to, to like check that and what i'm also doing is kind of pushing them in so you know like when you curl your hair you like hold the curl i'm trying to do that like this and i'm just leaving this little bit out so it looks a bit more natural okay Oh, okay. I'm just going from the back, making sure 
I'm kind of getting ones which are kind of in the same like sections of hair which are kind of like the same horizontal across if that makes sense and again really not close to the root at all like I don't want it anywhere near there I don't want the volume in the root because that's just as I learned from my mistakes before she's not a cute look I feel like the kind of trend at the moment is for the waves to be quite uniform as well to be fair when i did it last time after i slept on it and like a couple days after like it, it kept its wave really well and it did look quite beachy which i really did like but like when i first did it i was like oh, what have i done like that's not what we're here for like get out of my head at once something i'm also doing is just flattening the hair if that makes sense so it's flat so when it goes into the tongue it's like flat so it's not building up against each other if that makes sense who knows again quite an inch or so away from the root also just keeping it at this angle does that make any difference who knows when i did it closer to the root last time as well it just didn't leave any like hair at the end so that was another reason it just didn't look as nice as we wanted okay that didn't go too well i obviously didn't line it up very well but it's fine it's an under bit so we should be able to kind of work with it another thing sorry just so many things i'm just like thinking of is basically when i did it the other way around you can see can you see that like wider bit that left kind of like a kink in my hair which just wasn't <laughs> wasn't nice so at least when it's kind of this way round the kinks on the other side of the hair so you don't see it as much if that makes sense you know you know what I mean okay so oh my god how weird does that look <laughs> let's get into the full molly may life and what she does is she gets these clips so they are those ones which like don't mark and she uses that to kind of hold the curl so for these front bits i'm going to kind of show you my own take on that also so i'm really happy with the placement of where i decided to start the wave like it's probably about three inches down from my root are we going to fit this in one or no no do it in two it's fine it's gonna be easier to do like the lower level and then like a fringe after so just put that over there it really is important to brush it before you do it because you don't want any like frizz because that will just form in the shape which obviously is like not what you want okay so yeah it was good it started raining love that <gasps> the washing but my hair i feel like adding the extra 20 degrees on really helped as well if you want to know something so funny so my boyfriend being just a typical boy didn't realize that like heat tools like hair tools like go up to 200 degrees he's like 200 degrees what do you mean yeah hun, that's what it takes the rain stopped it's sunny again weird weather i didn't leave it for as long on that end bit just because it's quite damaged okay so these clips it's a tiny bit frizzy what well, not what we want okay so where you can see like a curl obviously around your face you want it defined but i'm just gonna fold this one in there let's get another one and do this on this one i like these ones back here so let's define these this is what we have so far am i living my molly may dream yeah honestly because my hair's so blonde as well at the moment i feel so beachy and just another thing just which makes this really good you know sometimes when you like curl your hair or whatever it feels gross like my hair doesn't feel gross like it feels okay i'm gonna put oil and stuff in it afterwards but yeah okay i'll come back when i've done the other side okay so i've done the other side of my hair i'm really really happy about how it's come out so i'm just gonna again just secure these little waves with the clips they look quite cool i feel very professional putting these in i cannot lie to you guys i'm just gonna take some of the beauty works argan serum which is just like an oil to just put through the ends i need like a pump like it really goes a long way i'm just using my fingers to like comb through i missed a bit yeah, I'm just using my fingers to comb it through and it just also kind of breaks it up just a tiny bit, not too much. Focusing on the ends because you just put a lot of heat on them. I'm probably struggling a bit. 
gonna take these out now you'll be able to see the final result okay thoughts and opinions i'm really happy with how it's come out actually i feel like even next time we could go even lower so it's just not quite as like big around here you can see a slight kink which i was trying to avoid but you know it's fine obviously this is fresh it will drop but these i 10 out of 10 would recommend also i got these like i said i got them on plt and i'm pretty little thing you can play with klarna and i just did it in three installments so it was like 21 pounds a month which is really good for these actually i would really recommend them i actually am really happy with them so i really hope you agree and i mean buy them i know there are other ones on the market as well but these are so good i'm so happy with them that's going to conclude today's video thank you so much for watching if you think i've actually managed to do the molly may style then give me a like Give me a comment let me know what you think if you want to get it yourself let me know i hope you enjoyed today's video and i'll see you in the next one bye